Hey everybody. Hey everybody. Just wanted to share a little bit with you. I had that picture at the beginning of the video. Mothman mask. It's uh, that gray one. Uh, today is currently the 14th of May 2021. I ordered that mask uh, two days ago on the 12th. Um, they had two different options. They had a gray one and they had a uh, dark colored one. Kind of like a real dark gray, almost black version of it. And between the two, the darker one's the one I order. <coughs> um, I don't have it yet. Probably be here within the next week or two. And, um, ordered it for one thing, because I thought it was pretty cool. And secondly, um, though it obviously won't be a Mothman documentary, documentary or anything like that, I've always kind of wanted to make a Mothman um, short film, kind of like a kind of lo-fi vibe short film about Mothman, kind of like a lo-fi horror film kind of vibe. And I finally got a mask ordered for it. Um, I, I kind of want to make it like a series, like a sh like a series of short films, like five to ten minutes. Probably closer to like five to seven minutes. Um, but I'm gonna do a second part. I'm gonna do another update video um, under underground television. Whenever I get the mask, just showing off the mask, maybe wearing it a little bit. And um, I think it's gonna be pretty cool. And then hopefully, not too long after that, I'll be able to start making some short films with the mask. Uh, currently in the setup of designing a costume for it. So, um, kind of go along with it. You know, kind of like a, I don't think it's actually going to be like a Mothman, Mothman kind of thing. Kind of like a, uh, probably more like a um, son of Mothman. Maybe like a character that's implying that Mothman made it, made it with a human and had it, you know, more of a, instead of just a humanoid moth, more of an actual, like, half moth, half human being. I don't know. Maybe, maybe like a wingless Mothman that wears clothes, that kind of thing. And that's something I'm going to be working on. Um, secondly, uh, there's a shop here in Crossville that I think is pretty cool. And I, I went in it for the second time today. It's been around a little while, but went in there with a co-worker of mine, like about two weeks ago. And I went there second time today. It's a little shop called Can I Hemp You? Kind of like saying, can I help you, but can I hemp you? I got one of the cards right here. Let me try to focus this in on it. has one of those little spell down and then the words over here has hemp spelled down in bold letters and for each letter uh, H hope E education M ministry P prayer and over on the other side over here it says this is the business card obviously it said it says it ain't your mama's weed um, it's run by Maggie Clark and Jerry Tuttle on 142 West Avenue here in Crossville, Tennessee. 
Um, their website is www.canihelptennessee.com. Email can I help tn at gmail.com. Do that right here. And legit, they're a cool little place. They sell uh, candies there. Um, they sell, uh, but they actually make themselves. They sell soaps. Actually, I think I bought the last of their soap today because they were they don't really sell their soap that well. And I got soap last time I was in there. It was like this lemon scented, and. Um, it was actually pretty nice. I'm about halfway through it. I got another bar of the lemon. And I got a few stickers I didn't even know they had last time. And uh, I'll show you some of these candies here. I actually brought them out with me and I kind of forgot about them. But, well, not that I had them, but I brought them out. Yeah, packets of candies. Like this has a. I got two bags of pina colada flavored, and has some information on it, which is pretty cool. I've actually last time I was in there, I got some of these also, and it's pretty nice. Um, also, my hemp based candies, um, you know, stuff like that. I'm pretty sure there might be some Delta 8, which is kind of like a legal form of weed. Um, so it's kind of nice. And honestly, like, I know I'm smoking a cigarette right now, but when, it's like whenever I eat these candies, um, these hemp candies, it's like, I don't, I don't have a craving to smoke at all, which is kind of nice. So, uh, I'm going to include a picture of the business card. They might not have Delta 8. I don't remember right off the top of my head, but, um, I'm going to include a picture of their business card at the end of this video, um, both sides of it, so you'll be able to actually look at it if you want to pause it you know, and write down the information so you can go visit it sometime, uh, if you can, and it's pretty cool, it's pretty cool, it's definitely worth the check out, and I'll leave you with that, and I'll do a, I'll do a part two, um, titled, uh, Underground Television Mothman Mask Part Two, whenever I actually get the mask in, like, I'll, take it out of the box and show it to everybody, wear it a little bit, and it'll be pretty cool. So, I hope everybody's looking forward to that, and then I'll start making some short films. And also, P.S., I know I have these moments in these videos, and I try not to rant, or I try not to go on side trails too much, but I know I've not been putting out too much material lately. It's not really, it's partially been because of this whole COVID thing, but it's also partially because, like, I just haven't been writing a whole lot. Okay, I have made a lot of promises. Like, I'm, gonna, I'm doing this, I'm going to do that, I'm going to do this, I'm doing that. It's going to be the, this soon, it's going to be soon, this is what I'm doing. I mean, giving you little teasers over the past couple of years. And I want to apologize for that, not really pulling through with anything. I just, I've been, I ain't going to lie, I've just been really unmotivated. And it's been a weird rut. And... Plus, I've been I've been working a lot lately. I took up a second job about a year ago. I've been working a lot, and it's just like on top of the like just unmotivation, being unmotivated. In addition to that, it's just like I haven't been do I really haven't been doing shit. In the last like four videos I put out were of uh, material that you know it's more or less stock footage I've gotten over the past like five to eight months, which I think it's. There's a few good shots in there, but it's mostly stock footage that I've gotten. So, um, I just want to let everybody know that I'm legit working on writing some material. I'm going to start 
hopefully filming a lot more again soon and providing some you know cool shit for you um, cool ideas and I can't promise you what or when right now but I know I have some Mothman ideas um, I'm starting to pick up riding heavy again and I'm gonna probably start producing the somewhat zines zines that I used to do called the story of the pistol a uh, pistol but poetry short stories social updates stuff like that um, but anyway I'm going to get the Mothman mask hopefully within the next couple of weeks and I'll show it to all of you. So it'll be pretty cool. Until then, peace out.